Hi brothers, uh, okay, today I want to talk to you guys about poor self-image. In life, you know, I guess we, we do things that cause us to feel bad about ourselves and things that shame us. But, you know, in Christ, there's always redemption and there's, you know, God doesn't see us the way we see ourselves. And most of the time it's us creating that feeling within us and it's an image that we created in our mind based on what society thinks or what society says um, I know I like to go to the ver to, to the book of Psalms where it talks about how God formed us you know in our inward parts within our mother's womb and the verse goes like this for you formed my inward parts you knitted me together in my mother's womb I praise you I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Wonderful are your works. My soul knows it very well. Um, and then I go to another one. Well, that's just to let us know, you know, God took the time to make us. So whether we feel bad, whether our image is, you know, we feel our image is not up to standard or we don't feel that we are where we have to be, we have to realize that the Lord made us. And that love alone guarantees us that we are better than what we think we are and then I'd like to go to Joshua 119 where the Lord tells us have I not commanded you be strong and courageous do not be frightened and do not be dismayed for the Lord your God is with you everywhere you go so you know no matter how we feel throughout our days and you know we might walk with our heads down and I for one you know feel feel that way a lot where you know I'm not proud of myself for the things I've done for the decisions I've made and where my life sits right now but I do believe in my heart that the Lord has something prepared as a blessing for me and my family and uh, that's what helps me paint a better image of myself and what helps me tell others you know the image that we have of self-doubt, poor self-esteem is not the way of the Lord because He gave us the spirit of honor, the spirit of happiness, the spirit of courage to, to step out there and know that everything is forgiven, everything is new in Him. So with that, brothers, I leave you and that is my version of what I feel the Lord is telling us about low self-esteem. God bless you guys.